It is centuries ago. You are a merchant on the back of a camel, riding through jungles and mountain peaks. You are traveling the spice road, carrying many treasures to trade and sell. 1943, World War II. You are a soldier driving a six by six truck on the most difficult piece of earth to navigate on this planet. This strategic route connects China, Burma, and India. Your mission is to transport supplies for the Chinese and U.S. troops, vital for the success of the war effort. You are driving the Burma Road. Hello, I'm Charlene Fontaine. Since 2005, it has been my privilege to be the executive director of the Flying Tigers 69th DRS Association. This hair-raising adventure is only a part of their story. This was the first time in history when squadrons were taken behind enemy lines to do whatever it took to keep the planes flying. That meant creating parts when there weren't any, working on battle-weary planes that were in pieces upon landing so they could return to complete their missions. The story of the Flying Tigers has been told many times, but few people really know the stories of what happened behind the scenes and what it took for the ground crews to support those brave pilots during the Burma campaign in China. Primarily, our convoy was loaded with uh, high-octane gasoline for the planes. And then our mission, once we got to uh, the Kunming, was the maintenance of the planes. We had more people trained that we could keep planes flying. Usually when you uh, you read about history, about the, about the CBI or China during the Second World War, the, most of the stories come down to flight crews, and I have the greatest respect for flight crews. But uh, the emphasis quite often is not about the people who kept those planes flying, because if not for us, they would not be flying those planes. And uh, we were bringing supplies over the most treacherous road in the world at that time. This massive operation was one for the record books. But the sad fact is, it has been left out of the history books to be forgotten. The stories of the 69th are only told to few family members or revisited at their reunions. That's where we come in. And the reason for this project, these men, their experiences and stories have much wisdom to share, life lessons to be learned, and international friendships that have bridged almost seven decades. It is my privilege to share how our organization is keeping the legacy of the Flying Tigers 69th alive and let you know how you can become involved. These gentlemen were young, 18 to 35 years of age, when they went to defend our freedom and that of the Chinese people. Now time has found us celebrating our oldest tiger dad at 102 years young. Most of his buddies are now gone. This is the reason for this push. The Flying Tigers completed their mission successfully knowing that the support of the folks back home was with them. It's now time for the next generations to become involved and carry this legacy forward. Our project has been in process for many years. It has been my honor to represent these humble men in the United States and China speaking on their behalf at many conferences, meetings, and reunions, and touring Air Force bases and building relationships with the current military personnel who today proudly wear the Flying Tiger patch. I will be traveling our country to visit and meet the remaining Flying Tigers from all squadrons. The collection of memories and pictures will be added to the ones already gathered. They will create a book as well as a documentary film. There are other missions being discussed for the future. Calling all flying tigers from each and every squadron. Please let us know where we can contact you. And if your tiger dad is watching over us right now, if you have stories to share, please let us know that as well. We invite you to join us on this journey. Your pledges support us to bring their stories to life. Financial donations are needed and are tax deductible. 
Our budget for this mission is $73,000. All types of donations are so welcomed. We appreciate air miles, hotel nights, rental cars, gift cards, gas cards, and oh yes, even cash. We are a 501c3 organization, so your donations are tax deductible. Please visit us at our website, flyingtigers69drs.org, and click on the Donate button to donate using your credit card via PayPal. You can also send a check or money order to the address on your screen, made payable to the Flying Tiger 69th DRS Association, Inc. Friend us on Facebook. Watch to see the progress in our funding, and as well, follow me on the journey across the road of the U.S. Thank you in advance for your support to accomplish this great mission. Our Tiger Dads are very humble and gentle men who are so honored to have their stories told. Please join us before one more Tiger's Flame has gone to the black border. Thank you. Ding Hao.